Butch Wilmore and Sonny Williams expected to be in space for just over a week when they took off last June aboard Boeing's Starliner capsule. Stranded in space after NASA declared the Starliner too dangerous to return in, President Donald Trump vowed to return them to Earth with the help of SpaceX chief Elon Musk. We're going to get them out. We're coming up to get you. I've authorized Elon. I said, can you get them out? Because, you know, they've been left up there. But that mission has been delayed too. The astronauts' extended time in space will have taken a physical toll. Exercise is such a big component of uh, any crew day on all the missions that we fly uh, because as soon as you enter that weightlessness um, environment, your, your body starts um, being responsive to that. And those, the calcium loss and the strength loss and the loss and the ability to work called aerobic capacity, those all start decreasing if you don't do anything to, to counteract it. Zero gravity isn't their only challenge, as the astronauts have been exposed to higher levels of radiation in space. We have some fairly defined and, and strict levels for the crew. We don't ever want them to get substantial amounts of radiation such that it substantially increases risks of um, concerning things like um, development of cancers and stuff like that. Isolated to the space station, which is the size of a large house, the astronauts have also had to work to maintain their mental health. You asked what we miss, right? Of course, you know, the things that we always miss, our families. I miss my two dogs. I miss my friends. We've had crew on orbit when their wives have had children or they've had family members pass away. And um, so there's a lot of work that goes into making sure that there's ways that we can touch base with them and see how they're processing all that, and as well as the, the stress of um, all the, the work and uh, the mission. And the challenge won't be over when their feet are finally back on the ground. Adapting to Earth's environment after a stint in space can take up to a year or even longer.